be the dual existence of human nature, right? That we need to engage with the positive and the negative emotions. Because we need to do something, something else with the, the problems, not only avoid them. Sometimes you cannot avoid a problem, but many times actually. Because, for example, if you, if you try to avoid a negative emotion or a, a negative part of yourself, I mean, it's, it's not something external you can avoid. You are avoiding yourself, part of, of yourself. So you break into pieces. Do you know what I mean? So you, it's not possible to escape. It's with you. All the places you go, they, it follows you, this negative thought, the negative emotion. It sounds like there's, in adversity, there is opportunity opportunity for us to grow opportunity for us to find meaning and to do that we need to engage with the adversity not distract and numb ourselves from it yes uh, because if you try to avoid and not take it as a challenge or as opportunity then you are going to have a, a bigger problem you have the problem of the situation which is difficult but you also have the problem that you you, you deny the the situation so uh, if you try to see what you can learn from the, the, the situation, the adversity, and how to integrate this situation into your meaning in life. And it's, it's more adaptive. It's, uh, but it's something that, which is demonstrated in, in the literature. It's, uh, it is the best way to cope with uh, adversity.